Hi, I'm Julie from juliesEatsAndTreats.com. Today we're gonna make overnight peanut butter banana oats. First, you'll take your milk. I'm using unsweetened almond milk, but any milk will be just fine. And then we're going to add our peanut butter, which I microwaved a little bit, so it's just easy to mix. And then we're gonna take our chia seeds and add it to the bowl. After that, we will take our honey and we'll pour it in there, and then we'll give it a really good mix. So just take and mix all the ingredients together until they're well combined. After that's mixed up, you'll add your old-fashioned oats. And you'll add it to your milk mixture, and then you'll give it another good mix. Once that is combined, you can either leave this in the bowl and refrigerate it overnight, or I like to put it in individual containers so I can grab it and go in the morning. And next you'll just scoop them into the mason jars. I use a measuring cup so I can get them in there nice and neat. And you'll just spoon it into three different ones as this makes three different servings. Make sure the milk is individually distributed between the jars as this the oats will soak up the milk overnight. Once you're done with that, just take your lids, put them on the top, and put them in the refrigerator. After the oats have rested overnight in the fridge, you'll want to dress them up a little bit. I like to put a little fresh banana on them. So you'll just slice up a banana and then you can place it on top of your overnight oats. I like to take a little bit honey to sweeten them up and you just drizzle a little honey into the jar. And then you're going to want to take a little bit of peanut butter. I put it in the microwave for about 30 seconds to make sure that I can drizzle it right on over the oats. After that, I just take a few chia seeds and I'll sprinkle them on top. You can get the full recipe on juliesEatsAndTreats.com.